Oh my, oh my, oh my, welcome. We are night two of the Minnesota State Fair. Thank you so much for coming out to Breaking the News, second time ever show at the State Fair. Super excited, and I thought, let's go big or go home, right? So before I go home, let's go big. <laughs> And we thought we'd bring the two most powerful people in the state of Minnesota in here to talk to us, and that is our governor and lieutenant governor. Yeah. I'll tell you, Governor Walls, welcome. Thank you. This might be your first breaking the news foray. It is the first breaking the news. Oh, Thank you for having me. What a beautiful moment we can share together and done. <laughs> The Lieutenant Governor has been on the show many times. Welcome back. Thank you so much. All right, so what we're gonna do is something called Fair Question. And here's how I like to play Fair Question when it comes to politics. We don't talk about politics, we just talk to politicians about other things. Fair? Fair. 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 Okay, you, are you into that? We're in. Good, we're because in. one Minnesota is not what I want to talk about. <laughs> Great. Thanks for that. You're welcome, <laughs> Governor Walls. Two years prior to your election, you promised your son Gus if you won, you'd buy him a dog. Are you a flip-flopper? Did you buy the dog? This is going to be, yes, we're buying him a dog. We have not bought the dog. No, no, we're buying him. Halfway through the term, we're buying him a dog. Here, here's the breakthrough. Last week, he dog sat for two beautiful, a Labradoodle and a Lab, and his mother watched how that 12-year-old bonded with those two beautiful dogs, and she said, okay, get the dog. So we're on now. So anybody, we're on. Can everybody just uh, give it up for Gus for being the most patient person in the world? <laughs> That's true. Wow. All right. Lieutenant Governor, you have a dog named Reuben. I do have a dog named Reuben. Is your dog named after a sandwich? Um, <laughs> that's a great question. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell a lot of truth right here. Oh my gosh, here it goes. That's what we call it, breaking the news, people. That's truth, right. Truth is happening. So uh, we adopted Ruben um, from Midwest Animal Rescue, and he's so wonderful. He's an Italian greyhound, so a mini greyhound and a dachshund mix. He's so cute. Um, and when we first got him, his name was Merlin. And that's okay, but I thought like people would be like, oh, she's super into like Dungeons and Dragons. And uh, not that there's anything wrong with that. Um, and I spent some time with him and I looked at him like, oh, your name's Ruben. And he seemed to like it. So he's had it for the last 10 years. Follow up question, just quick there. Have you ever promised your daughter something that it took you two years to follow through on? Is there uh, a reason I haven't <laughs> been on this show? I don't know, is there? Uh, I'm sure if she were here, she would give you a laundry list of things, <laughs> but I can't think of, of any. Of course you can. Of All course. Right. We may come back to that at some point down the road. <laughs> Governor Walls, you hosted the governor of Ohio here at our state fair, did you not? We did. This afternoon, Governor Mike DeWine was here at the Minnesota State Fair. Was he just trying to get some state secrets or actually get some fair secrets? No, this is a very unusual thing. Governor DeWine was being very honest. He said... The Ohio State Fair needs an upgrade, and he asked the other governors at the National Governors Association, where should he go to learn how to state fair, and he came here. Okay, I mean, we hear, you know, rumors. People in Wisconsin, Iowa, and Texas like to suggest that their fair is fairer than ours, and that's, I mean, that's adorable, but it's just not true. <laughs> But are you concerned that these other governors or other people perhaps running for president are coming out here to try and figure out how we do this whole fair thing and take our thunder, Lieutenant Governor? Is it possible to duplicate this magic? It is impossible to duplicate this magic because our fate, state fair is the very best state fair yeah. in the country. It's not, you know, like you can imitate it, but you will not be able to capture the perfection of what we've been able to do here in this state. Kind of like what Leah Michelle from Glee did with you. She could imitate you and your look, but she can't capture it in the same way. Uh, that's correct. I do look like Rachel Berry, uh, the character from Glee. Um, I changed my hair color, uh, but move. I was very, very serious about show choir. 
So we have some things in common. I, I love the reaction in the audience right now. They're like, oh my gosh, I see it. Yeah, yeah. it's delayed, it's delayed. Yeah. Uh, speaking of that, one follow-up on that. You and Leah Michelle had the same audition song from Les Mis, correct? What? <laughs> Did you sing On My Own from Les Mis to audition for something? Um, I actually sang On My Own uh, in the eighth grade talent show uh, at St. Louis Park Junior High School. Yeah, I did my homework. Yep. So uh, it was, uh, we won one first place, so, you know. Yeah, wow. Yeah. That's yeah. nice. That's actually the reason that we became partners in this once I you found out. You were in Les Mis? Right. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> the, the first place, that the, the multi-talented Peggy did Flanagan. It. That, was, that pushed it over. Really? Have you ever been in a talent show, Governor Walls? <laughs> Are you still does, with does, us, Governor Walls? Yes. I'm, does this race count? Does being governor count as that? I, no. No. I knew you'd, no, I have never no. been in a talent show. Oh, do you have any talents? I'd like to think so. Um, Besides the gas tax. I thought okay. we said no politics. Yeah, oh, yeah, everybody can, loves a good gas, gas tax yeah. joke. <laughs> Come on. No, I, I, I cannot sing, I don't think, on that. But I, maybe I don't have it. You, he's true. a football coach to the state coach. champs. Right, um, yeah, um, yeah, that's a big yeah. deal. You can, can clap for that. that. All uh -huh. right. I have one final question for you. Governor Walls, do you waltz? I do. I do not waltz either. I know, this is disappointing, isn't it? I think I live the most boring life of anyone you've ever met. Besides being the most powerful band, man in the state, everything else is boring and lame sauce. All right, it has been a pleasure. Will you come back? Absolutely. Of course. Okay, Yay. two more truths. Thank you so much. Thanks. Thank you so much, Jenna. It was a pleasure. That's your governor and lieutenant governor. We will be right back.